Well, it looks like gamers can't even mod the games they paid for because the biggest website for gaming mods, known as Nexus Mods, keeps banning people they disagree with and banning mods that they find offensive. They originally started doing this years ago with the PC port of Insomniac Spider-Man. Someone made a mod to remove the pride flags from the game. They banned the mod and removed the modder. But everyone is freely to make game mods of all the existing characters in games. You can put a, a trans flag on Doom Guy and Doom Eternal. Nexus mods will do nothing about it. But as soon as you do the opposite, you're gone, you're zapped, you're disintegrated, you're Thanos snap, you're banned. And we have yet another example of that, and this is with Angra Boda from God of War Ragnarok. She is this black female DEI character, yes I'm calling her that, because this is Norse mythology. Norse are Scandinavian, Germans, European nations, so it makes no sense to have a black person in God of War Ragnarok when it takes place in Norse mythology. And we all know Sony is gay. Someone made a mod to change the character to white here is that mod right here as you can see this is the character on the left again makes no sense for Norse mythology there should be no diversity in something like this we know how Sony is they are a Californian company now they left Japan years ago as soon as they came to California they became super fucking gay and on the right of that picture you see a more accurate depiction of what this character will look like or should look like I should say. And here is another picture showing different versions with different hair colors. But of course we cannot have this anymore. Because it got removed from Nexus mods. Because they are fucking retarded. Why would you go out of your way to remove something when people are coming to your website to support it by downloading mods on your website? Why can't these companies keep their own personal beliefs out of their company? Money is money regardless. This is why this makes no sense to me. Why should it matter where the money comes from why can't a lot of companies understand this take money regardless if it comes from someone on the left or someone on the right it's a fucking video game they could be people browsing your site looking for this mod getting you some money just by being on your site they could be wanting to pay for your membership you get no ads and faster downloads and stuff like that but you're fucking banned them because you are gay you've been like this in spider-man but not only nexus banned them they got banned by another website called game banana i'm not too familiar with this website but you can see the picture right here as you can see angry boda angry boda i don't know how to say that stupid bitch name but i don't care angry boda mod got banned gone they removed it they got offended as well this website is gay as well why can't these idiots just let people upload the content that they want as long as they're not doing anything illegal why can't you just upload a mod that restores the race of the character or at least the race that it should be but no you got to get offended because nobody can keep their politics out of their company anymore they openly turn away money in viewers or visitors because the website but they openly turn this away when it would mutually benefit both the the fans and the company that hosts these mods but they're fucking idiots i don't understand this money is money why are you denying this because you're offended but not only do they remove mods that do stuff like this like restoring the race of something or a character they have a clear double standard are you really surprised and what is that double standard you ask well you can make characters that are white and turn them black but you can't do the opposite look at this picture right here this is Geralt from the witcher someone made a mod to make him black but as soon as somebody does the opposite, uses a mod to make a black hair the white, you're gone, you're banned. Your mod is removed, nobody can download it. Unfucking believable with these weirdos. But not only does Nexus have a double standard, the website I showed before also has a double standard, the Game Banana website. And you can see this mod right here for Genshin Impact. And it's a dark skinned Mualani. Not sure if I pronounced that correctly. I don't care, I don't really play this like that. This game isn't even on PC, it's on the PS4. But yeah, you can see it, dark skin Mulani. No bans, no offensive content, quote unquote offensive content, because they decide what's offensive. This game is choosing what they want to do with their game that they paid for. But we can't have that anymore because people are so easily offended. And nobody should get banned for either direction. If you want a mod that makes the character black for whatever reason, go ahead. But you should also have the opposite if you want to do that as well. But they don't see it that way. They are hypocritical, offended, weak little pussies. They only care about pushing their ideas. 
ideas and now allowing people to do what they want with their game. You can put blackface on a character, but you can't do any quote unquote whitewashing. So it is what it is. I don't like these websites, but this is unfortunately the main place that people go to download mods and upload mods as well. I download mods for Arkham Knight on this site. I don't really care too much about this website because the games I play don't get mods like that. It's usually big AAA games that get mods. But people are going to continue to go to Nexus Mods because that is seen as the premier website for downloading mods. So not only do you have to wink a good website that's appealing has a good UI, you have to give modders an incentive to move to a different website instead of just continuing to use Nexus Mods. And on top of that, you have to make sure the website is profitable. So that's why I'm not getting my hopes up for anything anytime soon. For all you people who like AAA stuff, you like mods, it's going to be a rough road ahead. They're going to continue doing this. This is retarded. This is what every single company is doing. Every company can't seem to just let their politics stay behind the door. Can't just leave their politics at home. You have to bring it into work and have it affect your corporation. Instead of just making a good product that anybody can enjoy. And that's why all these different companies are falling off a cliff. They hate money if the money comes from someone they disagree with. It's fucking retarded. And it sucks for you God of War fans because I think the new design for Angra Boda looks pretty cool. Definitely better than the DEI garbage. Fucking disgrace of a company that Nexus is. So I don't have much else to say. I feel like I'm just going to keep repeating myself. So Nexus mods, you can go fuck yourself.